Um, you know, it's um, you know we've been working with a Medicare administrator to do something very similar. I think you're. I'm hearing a trend about moving to cloud and um, being able to work with them to optimize their IT operations, uh, look at a target operating model. And I think this is an important thing that we see is that we're, we're seeing people not doing technology for technology's sake, just not moving to the cloud to move to the cloud, but doing it for a purpose, right? And you know, their um, purpose was to free themselves up from you know, having to manage the applications and answer the phones and see the blipping red lights that we talked about earlier. Um, so that they could um, lower their cost of ownership so, and to free them up to take advantage of the technologies that are now available. So we used a target operating model uh, with them to say, what is it you're trying to accomplish? How do you organize yourselves in order to accomplish that mission? Uh, where are the opportunities for value? So looking at you know, the areas that you could, um, you know, I won't say divest, but go to a managed service, which um, we help them identify. And they're not only putting you know, their data centers, they went from one data, or two data centers down to one for a managed service, but they've also put their voice and data into the cloud, which has um, really been groundbreaking because they can now take advantage of some of the uh, artificial intelligence and some of the other um, uh, technologies that are out there, but without their data being available, without those cloud providers having the tools available to them, immediately, it would be months before they would be able to take advantage of those technologies versus, you know, weeks that it would be now. So we've had great success. It's taken a couple of years to get to mm -hmm. the point where things are now in the cloud, but now we're starting to convert, help them manage those relationships. I guess that's another element here too, is that when you do that, you're working with your vendors differently than before uh, and helping them have that vendor management framework and processes in place to feel comfortable that that's being managed well. So now they can focus on their consumer, their customer, uh, so and serving a, them better. It's a whole 